we entered into a contract with Talo in 2015 about the social investment projects in Turkana South that was called Lot 3. We did so well, they were so good to us by then, but when we finished our projects, we started invoicing them up to the, like, the fourth invoice. They started having issues with us. They told us now we are changing the formula of uh, invoicing. They told us to do what we call measurement of work. Measurement of work was, uh, by then, we refused. We said, because after calculating, it was not beneficial to us, but to them, it was a loss on our side. So we refused. We recalled all the construction site workers. Uh, then Talo wrote to us an email that we should resume. They have accepted the formula that we, we were doing in the first place. So we went back, finished our work. After invoicing them again, they delayed for like three months. When we followed up, they wrote us an email that they had overpaid us. So we didn't understand how can overpayment come up when we have not even finished the project. How can even their formula allow us to be overpaid? <laughs> for this situation. We ask those Talo people to pay the constructors. This is the only laboratory that we depend on. And as Katilians, we promise that we want to do best in sciences. And because they've closed our, domain, our laboratory, where are we going to start from? Our apparatus are starting breaking down. And we still have only four months to go for us to sit for our KCS as form fours in this school. How are we going to do this? Because our lab has already been closed. We feel so bad. <laughs> Eh, dom ambayo tulipewa na talo ndio yeye inaenda kurejeshwa sasa swali ni je sisi kama wanafunzi wa Kainuk mix secondary school tunatarajia tulale wapi na iwapo kuna tatizo au shida lolote sisi kama wanafunzi mbona tunahuzishwa mambo kama hayo talo plus na contractor wao pamoja waende wasungumzie hiyo kesi sisi wanafunzi afadhali eh, kabla mtetoka mali hapa hivi sasa tungependa kujua mali ambapo sisi kama wanafunzi tungependa kulala